Hello there, welcome back. Let's do a quick uh, random comments corner. This is where I comment on some of your comments. Okay, C128D, hello. He says Ubuntu Mate 16.04.01, hands down. Uh, go ahead and vote for the best Linux uh, distribution for this year. Uh, it could be anyone you like. It does not necessarily have to be one for beginners. Uh, I like Ubuntu Mate myself. And of course, Martin Wimpress also likes Ubuntu Mate. Do you know why? He helped develop Ubuntu Mate. Hello, Martin. Uh, we did a podcast, I think, last year. We should do another one. So thank you for the great work, Martin, on Ubuntu Mate. All right, Minato Arisato. I hope I said that correctly. I would recommend 16.04 version for a beginner. These non-LTS LTS releases are more aimed for people who know a little bit more about Linux and people who don't mind distro hopping. It would be better to give a beginner a system they don't have to worry about upgrading in less than a year. Yeah, I picked 16.10 uh, Ubuntu Mate for beginners also, but if you are completely new and newbie, perhaps 16.04 might be better. Terry's Tech and things, what's up? Installing Ubuntu Mate 16.04 as I'm watching this. I'm not sure what's going on with my Manjaro, but I'm on my third installation this week. The latest round of updates, update from their official repositories, brick my system, need stability for my business after all. Um, I don't know. I did Manjaro XFCE as a full install. It, it was great in the beginning. It was fast. But in the end, what can I say? For me, just one too many bugs, and I had to stop using it. But it was great while it lasted. Fidel Arnold. Hello. Random, but do you know what happened to Matthew Moore? Uh, I think Matthew's fine. The last time we spoke, we did a podcast a few months ago uh, called Car Speak, and I think he was buying a car, selling a car, something like that, but uh, that's all I know. I think, I think he's okay. Ghost67. What's up, Ghosty? I can't help but laugh at all this, and I'll be sticking with my text and talk dumb phone. Yeah, this has to do with the Galaxy uh, Note 7 from Samsung, and it's a, and, and, and the problems of it being a hot-selling phone. Anyway, uh, Ghosty says it's both flame and fireproof. Your dumb phone, I guess. What can I say? Milos the Eric. Hello, Milos. Hey, Toss. What's up with Spatry? His last videos from two, three months ago. Um, I think he's fine. I think we're doing a uh, Sinner report this Sunday night, maybe. Maybe. So stay tuned. And finally, Matthew Moore. I didn't like the last season. It was terrible. Hopefully, this one will be better. This has to do with the X-Files coming back, at least in pre-production spring 2017 in Vancouver. As far as this past season, this past January, I liked um, the first one. That They did six shows. I liked the first one and the last one. The cliffhanger, I thought, was spot on. Uh, it deserves a comeback. I think since both actors, both of their respective TV series have been canceled, which means they will have lots of times, a lot, lots of time on their hands. So I think they'll be back to do, I'm guessing, at least 10 episodes, maybe more. But the cliffhanger I thought was awesome. All right, so what else do I have? So for this month, don't forget to vote for the October 2016 YouTuber of the month. One comment, one vote. Vote for the best Linux operating system for this year. One comment, one vote. Again, it does not necessarily have to be about uh, something for beginners as far as the operating system goes. Uh, pick anything you want, and I will tally the votes by the middle of next month, I do believe. Well, that's all I have for this one. If you guys would like to see a review on something or talk about something else, let me know. Subscribe and support this channel if you haven't. And as always, enjoy your technology, and please don't text and drive. Take care.